The convenient way of determining the location of an ellipse is like this. For this, we will draw the ellipse first with the semi-major axis length of equal to 10 units, say, and the semi-minor axis length of, say, equal to 8 units. Now the ellipse is say x squared divided by s squared plus y squared divided by b squared is equal to 1. So this is the ellipse for which we want to determine the location of the foci. For this, we need to draw one circle from any of the endpoints of the minor axis with a radius of the semi-major axis. So for this, we will draw with a toolbox for quick drawing. So for this, we will need to know the endpoints. So for this, we will select the intersect command so we will select the objects for which we want to determine the intersect a and b are the endpoints of the minor axis so from a or b we will draw circles with a radius of the semi major axis so for this we will select the circle command here there are many options for circle we will select the circle with center and radius so we know the center and the radius the radius is equal to the length of the semi major axis so it is 10 so this is the circle now we need to know the point of intersection between the circle and the major axis so we will again select the intersect command and we will select the circle and the major axis so c and d are the two points of intersection between the circle and the major axis so these are the focus points of the of the ellipse